everybody. Welcome to another episode of Let's Open Some Packs, uh, where we open packs and we talk about them. I have two things to tell you first before we get started. The first one is I'm doing a giveaway for this deck here. Uh, pretty cool deck. <laughs> uh, it's the Iron Man Mark 33 uh, Silver. Uh, you can go to... I'll put a link down in the description. You can watch the video. I did a review on it. It's a really cool deck. Um, and you can win one. Or other ones. You can like choose. Uh, and that, that one's almost over. So, yeah. And then the second thing is, is I'm doing a video on my uh, new deck that I'm working on. So it's going to be a long series. Um, pretty excited about it. Uh, and there's... I'll put that link in the description as well. It's a short video. Just showing you the preview of the deck. Um, but yeah, that's it. And now it's time to talk about why you're here. Why you clicked. Which is... Oh, and here's... I haven't opened this yet. I just got this Kickstarter back in. And I have seen some of these before. I want to say he did did a French fry one first in the early one. Did you know, and by the way, the reason it got me was because of my two favorite things. Two of my ten favorite things uh, were in this Kickstarter. Um, oh, cool, you get stickers. I love stickers. What? This is a good sticker. This one. <laughs> this one's cool. Too. This, could, this looks like... This is the one, the cheeseburger. <laughs> I love cheeseburgers. Um, I'll leave these out so we can. But yeah, oh, what's this? It's like a fast food membership card. Cool. All right. Um, don't know what that's all about, but that's cool. I'll take it. Um, cool. So I saw this Kickstarter. And I saw this tuck box. Actually, I think I saw this one first. That's what it was. I saw this one first and I was like, that's pretty cool. Because I like beer. In fact, I like beer. Mm. This is actually a really good beer that I that's local. Um, okay, so yeah. So I saw this and I was like, this is a really cool tuck. Look at that. And I had seen his other cards before. Oh, number 23. I got 23 of 18... Thank you. I don't know what number this one is. Um, and I did the Kickstarter. And then I went to, uh, for this, because I clicked on the image, and then this one came up. And I was like, what? And I'm like, I got to do the Kickstarter. Because cheeseburgers and beer? Look at that. Doesn't that look cool? Okay, so I did the Kickstarter, and then I went to, um, was it SoCal? I think it was SoCal. And they had these, like, on the front page. And I was like... Oh, I'm a, oh, I just backed a Kickstarter for this. And this is 2021. Uh, is this is 2022? Oh, I didn't say since 2021. So I guess he started in 2021. Um, and I didn't back... Whoa, the popcorn one. Okay. So anyways, these look really cool. And they're printed in Taiwan. So they're Taiwan. They're done by... Um, here, I have it up this time. I, I'm going in blind. I don't know what anything looks like, by the way. But I will give you the, the, uh, the person's name that designed them, which is... Uh, Richard Lee, I believe. Rich Lee. His name is Rich Lee. Uh, he's a magician from New York and cardist from New York City. Um, so he loves sleight of hand and, and, and fast food. And we're like practically brothers already. Uh, <laughs> hello, brother from another mother. Anyways, I, I didn't get any other ones. And I think it's okay if you don't eat your burger with fries. So I was like, oh, man, it would have been good. But it's like, no. Burgers and beer go great together. When I lived in Germany, people would eat fries by themselves. And they would put mayonnaise on them. And the mayonnaise was so good. I don't care what anybody says. French fries and mayonnaise, the best. All right, so let's open the tuck box on this one. looks amazing, by the way. I didn't know it was... Uh, I had it I had it tucked away waiting for, the, for this Kickstarter to come in. So we'll look at these in a second. But this is pretty much a full... Me oh, I guess you wouldn't drink a cola and a beer. You'll get a stomachache. Uh, but yeah, let's do these first, since these came out first. Uh, and they're Taiwan. And the colors on these are fantastic. Look at this. This is the cola one. Oh. Look at that. Doesn't that look cool? It's red. It's red and blue, which is basically Pepsi and the Cola Wars. The Great Cola Wars. 
Uh, and here it is right here. Cola playing cards designed by Rich Lee, made in Taiwan. Uh, and he's in there. Look at that. There's a seal. Oh, oh and this is numbered as well. So this is 386 of 1999. Sorry, seal. You are a very nice seal, but you must go. Ooh, it's got like a silver top. Really good design. Really good design. And they're Taiwan. I think they're thin. Ooh, okay. So let's see. Coca-Cola. Ooh. I keep saying Coca-Cola. You, you know, when you go to a restaurant, this is really interesting. I lived in Chicago for a while. I'm from Texas. And I've lived in LA. And I lived in, in Hamburg. And I've lived in different cities in these, in these places. And people say... They don't say cola uh, everywhere. Like in Texas, you'll go to a, a restaurant and you'll say, can I have a Coca-Cola, please? And they'll go, or a Coke. Can I have a Coke? And they'll go, yeah, what kind of Coke? Would you like a Sprite? We have Mountain Dew. We have Pepsi. <laughs> so they say Coke for everything. It's like Kleenex. That's a brand. Or like Q-tip. That's a brand. A Kleenex is called a facial tissue. Um, look at that ace. <laughs> uh, and when I lived in Chicago, people would say soda water. I'll have a soda water, please. And they'll be like, what kind? You want Pepsi or Coke? We have Mountain Dew. And it's like, what? what why don't you say, do you have a, can I have a Coke? <laughs> they're like, that's a brand. And I'm like, you're right. Um, and I think in, Ger in Germany, they would say uh, fizzy water. I can't remember what they would say. No, that's like that's like something out of like San Francisco because it's all like Texan or Western. Okay, cool. So you get two two ad cards. I'm sorry, I'm black. Ooh, it's that Taiwan, yo. And you know these are gonna be good for cardistry. All right, so let's see. So that's the Ace of Spades. Looks like it's custom um, uh, suits and custom indices. Uh, let's see. Ooh, oh, and custom courts too. I want to say I saw that in the, in the glance. These are custom, right? The faces and everything. Really nice. Really nice job. So this is like a movie theater experience. I get it now. Uh, hence the popcorn. And you do usually get a Coke or a co See, I did it now. I don't drink Coke. Well, you know what I do drink is I really like um, cherry Coke. And when I was living in uh, L.A., there was a joint I'd go to that had... Um, they had Diet Cherry Coke. It was so freaking good. Oh my goodness. And I'd get like that and they had Bratwurst. Um, oh, that's a really nice queen of clubs. Um, you see that? Like her hair even matches like the clubs. It's pretty cool. I love these. Good job. Oh, look. The clubs are nice. They're like, they're like frumpy. <laughs> I like them. Um... Oh yeah, that looks good. Cause you got the ice. That's that's cool, man. Good job, Rich Lee. Good job. Loving these quartz, man. These are nice. Oh, a little preview, a little popcorn preview there for the next uh, for the next deck. I'm sorry, I'm ADD and I'm I'm going off on the. Okay, here's the last one. So, and we'll look at the back, and then we'll do some some we'll do some trickery here. Um, I would get a bratwurst, a hot dog. And popcorn every time at this theater one of the best movie the uh, the best movie theater I've ever been to in my life is probably the Alamo Draft House have you been to the Alamo Draft House greatest theater ever second greatest theater is Arclight and then the third would probably be IMAX because it's just like it's just like the volume is turned off these are really nice cards Taiwan too, man. That Taiwan is good stuff. Good stuff. And these don't stink. Really, they, uh, let's see how these see up. And they ferro like butter. But this isn't the butter one. The butter one's going to be on the cola. Let's go straight over there. All right, so these, oh, we didn't fan. So I got to have like a little, ri <laughs> you know I can't. You know I can't. <laughs> I don't even know. Uh, but sometimes you can see really cool stuff when you fan. They feel really good. You saw I just did for Lego Love there. They feel like they're grabbing the packets. Like it's like super easy. 
Anyways, all right, so we'll do... Oh, right, we're doing these, we're doing these last, because they're, they're the old Kickstarter ones. I'm gonna grab a sip of my beer before we get to the craft beer section. By the way, this towel is not because I'm gonna go outside. <laughs> it's because so of the condensation. And then it gets on the carts. It's like, oh man, when you get just one drop of water on a card, of any liquid, it just like, it ruins the whole deck. It's like, oh, uh, it's like the pee. The pee, you know the pee in the bed with the princess? What is that called? You know where they put one little pee at the very, very bottom? That's what it's like with the deck. It's the same thing. Man, I love this tuck. These are fantastic. These are fantastic. I'm gonna have to try to get the other ones. I should have got more. But I'm loving these, man. Great back design on this one. And look at this tuck. I don't know if you could tell, but that's... Um, it's plastic. It's like see-through. Man, this is nice. Good job, Rich Lee. Look at that. This is a really cool deck. And this is... 353 of 1999. Nice. You know, every once in a while, I'll get some decks where I'm like, oh yeah, cool, okay, they're doing, look at, see, look at that, it's like transparent plat, just like a popcorn machine. Um, and they give you the little popcorn thing, look at that, it's a sticker, I think. That's cool, you're, go you're gonna stay in there, I'm not gonna put you anywhere. Look at that, oh, you got a little reveal. Nice. Seven of Clubs. That's cool. So you can do a little, uh, you can go like, was that your car? Well, you totally saw this. I'm sorry. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Okay, so let's do, uh, okay, we're only doing two. That's right. Popcorn. I don't get pop butter on my popcorn. It's disgusting. That's not butter. That's grease. <laughs> They're like, would you like some butter on your popcorn? I'm like, that's not butter. Put real butter on there and I'll eat it up. Anyways, I like my favorite kind of popcorn is just straight up, um, very lightly salted, even cooked maybe in coconut oil. Um, oh, cool. Okay. Oh, so it's very similar to the cola one, right? Let's see the cola one. Oh, I already mixed all these up. Yeah, okay, so he has the tickets with the thing. Okay, so it's like a movie theater experience. Wonder what the craft beer and uh, man, burgers. When we get there, we'll talk about burgers. I love talking about burgers. Love these aces though. Doing a little thing there. So he's doing the same courts or the same uh, indices in the same suits as the other deck. Different, slightly different colors. Look at that dude. He's like, I'm gonna get my snack. Look at him looking down. <laughs> he's so happy. Oh, look at that. Chef's kiss popcorn. Perfect. Um, yeah, that's how I like my popcorn, by the way. Just straight up salt, very light salt. No, uh, maybe real butter. Oh, he's drinking a soda. Okay. Um, oh, we haven't looked at the back design. We're going to get there in a second. We're going to get there in a second. We're looking at the courts and the, and the aces. Oh, she's on her phone. Get off the phone in the theater. Oh, I got a story about that. Oh my goodness. Um, I, you know, we should be talking about popcorn. <laughs> but it's just like with the phone. Um, uh, what is it? Caramel corn? Or not caramel corn. Um, this is the most ADD video I've ever made in my life. What is it? What is it called? The corn? The popcorn that's... Kettle corn. My wife can make kettle corn. And she just like, she like looked it online. Like, How do you make kettle corn? It's so easy and it's so freaking good. And I say it's so easy, like I can do it. I can't do it. She does it. Um, but yeah, kettle corn is the best. The best other kind of popcorn. In Germany, they don't do buttered popcorn, by the way. When I went there, they did... Uh, um, oh, we didn't do anything with this dick. They did, they did kettle corn everywhere. Those felt weird. Those felt a little floppy. Could be me. I'm out of it. I'll tell you all my phone story real quick. I'm in a movie theater. We're in Hamburg. We're in downtown Hamburg. Uh, me and this dude were watching, I think it was Inglorious Bastards, maybe. 
and we're watching this movie. And this woman, there's like a family sitting behind us. And it's like an international theater. It's like, so the movies are all in English. And um, the woman gets a phone call and just starts talking. Like full volume. Like not even trying to be like, hey, I'm in a, hey, I'm in a movie, you know. Hey, can you call back? No, she was like, hey, what's up? And she's speaking in another language. I don't know what language it was. Uh, but she was not American. Um, and she was not German. <laughs> she was something else. And she's just talking. Like straight up. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, of course, yeah. And I turned around and I was like, excuse me, can you, can you stop? And she got mad, yo. <laughs> she got mad. And like, I think there were like, there was like other people, like her mom and like her sisters or something. They all jumped in and they were all like, what did you, this is not your movie theater. You can't tell us what to do. And like, it was like, whoa. <laughs> like y'all are being so <laughs> Anyways, that theater had really good popcorn. That theater had um, kettle corn. Very good. Because they didn't have, uh, like I said, they don't do buttered popcorn. Let's do the beer first. Because cheeseburgers are my favorite. Um, oh, now I get to talk about beer. Nice. Um, this beer I'm drinking now actually was, they put it in a can. Like, they have a machine at the counter. And every time I go up there, I'm like, can I get it in a can? And I feel bad because I got to do it. Because <laughs> it's a lot of work. It's not just like pouring it in glass. They have to put it in a can and put like special like CO2 or something in there and then clean the can and then do this and all this. And then they pour the beer in there and then there's like stuff to write on the side like the ABV and they write all this stuff on there. All that. And then I just drink the beer in like five minutes. But the reason I do that is because if I get the whole six pack, <laughs> like it's like, no, then I just keep drinking the beer. So the place I go to is... Um, they're in Magnolia. What, what is the name of the joint? It's uh, Lone Pint. Very good beer. They're, the one I'm drinking is a, a Yellow Rose. I think they've won awards for this one. Many. Considered one of the best IPAs. Anyways, craft beer. Yes. I like craft beer. It is amazing. And I have a friend that makes beer. And I went to his house. And you know, everybody has a friend that makes beer, right? No, I have a friend that makes beer. Uh, Rich Lee, I love that little thing you do there. Uh, oh, the seal. What number is this one? 23 of 1800, right? I didn't check the cheeseburger. Come on. I didn't check the cheeseburger. This is number 23, yo. Um, I have a friend when he's like, I make beer. And I went to his house. Yo. Let me, let me tell you something about people that make beer. There's the kind of people that just get the little kit and you put it in the fridge or in the closet or whatever. We'll start with the back side on this one. Pretty cool. Green. Green like a bottle. That's good. And he's got the little, uh, what is that, wheat? It's wheat, right? Not hops. Wait. Oh, okay. So here we go. Beer. That's cool. I like these. And at, at his house, this dude has... He probably has won like 150, 200 awards from beer beer competitions. That's a nice ace. So he's got awards everywhere. And he has this whole, all these amazing technology. He, do, he doesn't do the thing where he just puts all the stuff in a thing and throws it in the closet. No, he makes like award-winning beer, man. It's so freaking good. I love the contrast here, by the way. And he does like 2% beer and like 3%. So it's like you're tasting like these really delicious drinks. And you're not getting hammered or anything. But they're really good. And he like he did this IP. Oh man, I could talk about it all day. That's cool. Alright. I love the colors he's doing too. So he's doing black and he's doing beer. <laughs> it's like that's beer. That's beer. It's nice. What is this going? What's going on there? Interesting. The hair. How he did the hair in that one. 
Was it like that on the other one? Oh, wow. Yeah, they're different. The dude has a cheeseburger. So it's like, I like how he like joins the themes, beer and burgers. Good job, Rich Lee. Good job. And I love these little frumpy aces. Uh, clubs, I mean. Look at that. That's cool. That's a good one. That's not how you hold a beer, last lady. I'd yell at her at the bar. Hey, put it. You're going to drop your beer. <laughs> I wouldn't say that to her. Oh, I was at. Oh, I shed. I can't tell y'all. Man, I opened my mouth at the wrong time so many times. Can you imagine? But I've said things before <laughs> where it's like, oh my goodness. Why are you talking, dude? Cool. So I'm digging these so far. This cola one's my favorite one, the cards so far. And this one here is just awesome. I did not expect, like, I got these because of the burger one. Like, I saw the beer one. I'm like, I want to get the beer one. And then I clicked on the thing and I saw the burger, the burger tuck. Like, that's going in my case. Look at that. Burger. So good. Getting a little, a little tipsy here, Mr. <laughs> With a knife. Let's close you up so nobody gets hurt. All right. Man, this tuck box is awesome. I want to make a burger deck now. Richly, you're inspiring me to make a burger deck. I want to make a burger deck, Richly. Oh, you know, I also I did a video once on the pizza one, and it was awesome. It was like really cool deck. They did two. It was like they were. I think they were both veggie pizzas, right? Um, and this is oh, this is one thousand five hundred and forty-eight of eighteen hundred. But yeah, so I should not have put you away. The seals are really nice on this. They're like really, really like, they got the nice metallic. I love the tuck too. You're getting these tucks made in, uh, in Taiwan too at the same place? Where are the tucks getting made? So this is what, what got me, the back design. I want to say the picture I saw <clears throat> had, it was like the tuck. And if you notice, the colors are in there. The, com the colors of the lettuce and tomato. Um, and I think that's that's awesome. It, it adds this, it adds, it's the burger. Like if those colors weren't there, it wouldn't be a burger. It would look like, it could be anything. <laughs> you know what I mean? Let's take a quick sip before we go. Oh no, see, and I got some beer. That's why the napkin's here. I got a little bit on my finger. And I don't want to get that on the um, cards. Back design. Full burger color there. Love it. These are cool. Oh, wait. Let's get rid of the two jokers. Burger. So it's like a burger stand. Okay. It looks like a place I remember. I think it was in Chicago. No, it was in LA. It looked just like that. That's a cool ace. That's a spade right there. A burger. That's a spade. This is the most powerful spade in the universe. A burger. Boom. You win, sir. Interesting what he's doing with the hair there. It's like... It's very like... They look like rolls. That's not how you hold a burger, ma'am. <laughs> Ooh. Steak? A steak burger? Okay. So you don't get the burger, you get the steak, huh? Oh, she's got a fry. Man, I want a burger now. Oh, burger and beers right there. Boom. Same one as before, I think. Oh, she's putting a little bit of that sauce. Where's the burger at, though? She's waiting. She's like, when they bring my burger... When they bring my burger, I'm going to put so much sauce on it. <laughs> She's just like creeping. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> Jack of clubs. Eating a club sandwich. That's a club sandwich. That's not a burger. All right, let's 
Let's see what we got here. Ooh, cheese. Do you get cheese on your burger? I get cheese on my... Oh, by the way, we're not even talking about burgers. You know what? My favorite burger of all time is the Big Mac. I said it. Uh, I don't get Big Macs anymore, but I love the Big Mac. I wish there was a place that made a respectable Big Mac. Like a Big Mac that's like all the ingredients are organic, you know? But now it's like, man, I feel like garbage if I eat a Big Mac. And I also eat Whataburger. We have Whataburger here. Um, In-N-Out. There's an In-N-Out by my mom's house. In-N-Out is fantastic. The In-N-Out burger, when you hold it, it looks like the most iconic burger ever. Like, it looks like a burger. It doesn't look like, uh, I don't know. Like, it, you know, like, like Whataburger doesn't, Whataburger is all smushed in it. Like, it, it looks good. It tastes great. But in and out like, it looks like this. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, it looks like a burger. Uh, I love in and out uh, Yeah. Anyways, let's talk about the cards. Not burgers. Burgers and beers. I was about... And then I fan. <laughs> and then I... Oh, my goodness. It's not the cards, I swear. These do feel a little bit... Um, maybe because I had that... Because I got that beer in my hand. They feel really good, though. These all feel really good. Um, they're great for cardistry. Like, I'm, I'm feeling the, uh, they have this, like, really, really soft. You feel that? It's, like, really, really soft on the edges. Here, I could probably do this, yeah, without even, see that? Usually you have to break in a deck to do the, to do the, uh, the forward cut there, like that. See that? And these cards out of the box. Good stuff. Anyways, that's the review. Thanks for watching. Um, God bless all of you. Rich Lee, good job on these fast food. I don't have the other ones, uh, so I don't know how those are, but these are great. Uh, my favorite one is probably, you know what? I didn't think it was going to be this one, but it's the cola one. The cola and the pop. I got this Kickstarter, and I'm really digging these. These are like, I like them all. Um, they all feel great, too, right out of the box. Just so you know. Anyways, God bless all of you. See you in the next video. Cheers. Woohoo!